y'all, it's Norman's coming at you with a little bit of glass onion, a Knives Out mystery, starring <laughs> your boy, Daniel Craig. <laughs> Before we get started, you guys might notice that we're all ripping baller jerseys. Mine even Only says guys. New Sense 88 on the back. Uh, we don't believe it. If you're hype enough to be on the Talking Normies podcast, then maybe you've seen these joints right here. We're going to steal them. We're we'll out them. here. We'll uh, steal them. We got these from a company called DIYOJ.com. Yeah. And if you use code The Normies, you can get 10% off. These boys are custom made. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's straight up stitched embroidery in there. It's, it's super just, high quality. Nah, custom. Oh. Custom. You better oh. fucking show them. There's tell. Mickey's butt. Yeah. Custom. Yeah. You guys have not even in the frame. Sit down. Sit down. Uh, well, it was, it's custom. I'm, I'm, it's custom. Trust me. Stop putting your ass on the table. Okay. You too can have this and more. <laughs> you can have this. So, glass onion, a knives out mystery. Who saw knives out? Put your hands up. We watched it together. Who enjoyed watching it? It was great. Who's excited for this? Yay! <laughs> I'm excited for this because I think it's going to prove my theory from several reactions ago that Batista might be the best uh, oh my wrestler turned actor. <laughs> oh, Batista <laughs> might be the best wrestler turned okay. actor. All right. yeah, you know what? You know what? Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy three is his last time playing Drax. Yeah. And, and do you know why? 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 He said he's giving up the role because he doesn't want to be pigeonholed into that character oh. and, 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 he, and he wants to do more dramatic roles so he's, okay. he's given up an mcu contract to pursue acting so nice. hmm. so well this movie will help us understand if he can do any other role than the track also so we'll fun fact this movie is going to take place on, it's not a really spoiler the location this place uh, movie takes place in is is for sale now Ooh. For four hundred and fifty million. Spoiler. Might have to get that for myself. I don't know about you peasants, but I got coin for it. Hey guys, make sure you support the OG <laughs> where, content. Where is this coin, Chris? <laughs> hey guys, make I would sure like you... to know. <laughs> it's from it's my mistress. She's very oh, but it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> um, hey guys, make sure you support the OG content by heading over to Netflix and checking us out. This joint is up there right now. Also, if you are interested in what we got going on on Patreon, you could be watching this early access style over on our Patreon. That's a reason to join. Also, you get uncuts and on other shows, you can get premium access, which is way far ahead, yeah. and early access. We got Bleach up on there right now, and we got Euphoria up there as all of it completely. You could be there watching it all, and um, Ted Lasso's on its way up. Ted Lasso's there, so. on there. Ted Lasso. A couple oh, of everybody loves Ted Lasso. Why don't you guys go and check it out? And we're about to jump straight into this. Oh, I love her! Mm-hmm. May 13th, 2020. 2020. Pandemic game. I can't keep making excuses for everyone with Miles Brown's insane whims. Genius or insanity. Remember child equals NFT? We all laughed, but then the Crypto Kids app paid for this building. Oh my God. <laughs> is Miles Braun supposed to be like Elon Musk or Jeff Bezos maybe? If your name is on this and it fails, it will sink you forever. Bro, what? Well, it's funny too, cause like, you know, it's during the pandemic. Yeah. Yep. Uh, <laughs> no. It's Kate Hudson, everybody. That's Goldie yeah. Hawn's daughter. Kurt, Russell, and Goldie Hawn. No phones. Why can't she ever phone? Because she's afraid that I will tweet an ethnic slur. <laughs> Again. <laughs> what is this thing? Well, it's a Miles invitation. How do you open this thing? Will you shut it? Let me whisk your life, you got a list. God damn! <laughs> Tell your mother to shut up. She is mom, sorry. She's got a delivery, it's in the kitchen. She made him hold it so she can smell <laughs> <laughs> yeah. well, My mom already broke it. It's a stereo brand. Did to it, it opened up. It's oh, the, the thing you stare at, you put close to your face. Oh, the Magic Eye Boys. Right oh, there. yeah. It's a chessboard. It's set up for a, a maiden one. Should I? Do it, Gaspar. <laughs> Nice. Oh, Bro. nice. This is sick. Is this a real box? I want it. It's tic tac toe. Normies. Right. Oh, it is. Yeah. Oh, oh, it is. <laughs> we said this. It's music. Guys, it's music. It's music. I do want to be music. This is Boss Little Fugue in G is that Yo-Yo Ma? Yo-Yo Ma is, is, is it Yo-Yo Ma? Yeah. Layered this tune on top of itself. It starts to change and turns into a beautiful new structure. See the center wheel lifted up. I want this. What the fuck? Oh. This guy's got too much time on his hands. It's like a Mondrian golden ratio spiral. Fibonacci. Or a Fibonacci. Yes. Yeah. yeah. 47 for sure. The atomic number for silver. You sure that's silver? It looks that's like silver. it. That'd be sick. 
you are cordially invited. For as long as we get on a private island. All right, well, the mystery is set up. Y'all better oh, never send me something like this. Because <laughs> you're not going to open it. I'm not going to I'm not going to make it. Was she not on the call, or Damn. was she just a whole new person? Call. Oh, yeah. Oh, See, no, God. yeah, I would have been there. I would have made it. This is Spidey. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Makes total sense. Yo, what? Among Us? It's a murder mystery. Yeah, yeah. clever. I saw you go in there. That's Angela Bassett. <laughs> <everybody. laughs> Angela Lansbury was in Murder, She Wrote, and Murder, She Wrote was a series of murder mystery novels for anybody that didn't know that. Murder, oh. She Wrote was great. Hmm. Never watched and a TV show. <laughs> That's Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. <laughs> World's greatest detective. Lockdown hasn't been easy for any of us. But Phil told me you haven't left the bath for a week. You're not in the bath again, are you? No. <laughs> <laughs> I need a great case. Someone here for you. In the box. Ooh. Ooh. Ha-ha. Amazon? <laughs> <laughs> Love her style. Is she seriously wearing a mask? Oh, is she? It's, it's like a clear mask. It's like oh. what, chicken wire. Did you solve the murder of, oh, what's your name? That, um, the politician yeah. wearing her mask wrong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We've arrived. Okay. No mask. Oh, no, at all. Do you remember my girl, Whiskey? Hi. Whiskey? Whiskey? Huh. Why are you in Greece, Mr. Blanc? I was invited by Miles Braun. Benoit Blanc is going to help solve the mystery of Miles' murder. <laughs> this should be fun. Cute. Ladies and gentlemen. What? what? Ethan Hawke? First, I'm going to need you to remove your mask. This will only be momentarily uncomfortable. What? Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? That sounds awful. No. No, Should've went first. I don't want that. Oh, pineapple on that, right? Eight years of doing these trips, you're the first new person he's ever invited. Okay, so this happens a lot then. <laughs> what? Like, it's the movie could happen. Just don't ask. Uh-uh, there she is. Oh my god. I want those earrings. Damn, stun. Pull Where's this down. island? I think it's a fictional island. Mm, makes sense. No, 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 no. The, I, the island they're going to is real. The island they're going to is real, and that's the island that's for sale now. Andy started Alpha with Miles ten years ago, just a tour. One legal move, cut her out completely. Damn. Damn, she got Walter Whited. The question is, why do you fight him? It's why did she show up? To kill him. Because he's dead and she wanted to laugh at it. $450 million, you guys want to go in? Let's go. Yeah? Yeah. What the what moolah? Yeah, what does this come with it? I don't know, 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 know if this part's real, but. That's clouded. Is that the name of the island in Greek? Piece of shit. 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 Hilarious. Okay, Edward Norton. Edward Norton? Dude, Eddie Norton. What the fuck? <laughs> Love that necklace. Great. Huh? Sure, that's what you're looking at. Mm -hmm. They're gonna. Fuck. Yeah. Well, they're already. Oh, yeah. oh that's a little too long, okay. sir. Yeah, that's a little, too, that's a little uh, weird. When well, you throw a murder mystery party, you do it right, buddy. I cannot overstate my gratitude for so this. Happy to me? He's a god damn. Uh, 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 Can we just take a second and fully abbreviate this moment? Abbreviate? <laughs> Fuck off. Is that a word? <laughs> no. Just our gang. Just us. Hey, hey. <laughs> what? Okay. What? Who's that? That's Daryl. He's he's just staying here. He's going through some things, but he's not part of the experience. What about? Uh, so what am I supposed to do? I'm being paid to be here. Oh. It's like an actual Ooh. huge glass onion. Norming. <laughs> you made it so hard. <laughs> what? Um, what? Dong. I really am glad you're here. Do you know <laughs> Hey, Mr. Blanc, we have a quick word. Andy's gonna kill me. <laughs> I mean, somehow your boy literally got a gun through customs or he picked up a piece as soon as he hit Greece. I'm concerned. <laughs> <Bro>. <laughs> Looks custom. Doesn't look like he bought it. <laughs> what the fuck is that thing? Oh my god, it's full of stars. <laughs> <laughs> is that a motor car? That's my baby blue. Why is it on the roof? Because there's nowhere to drive it on the island. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it brings like 10 more questions, bro. <laughs> what are you doing here? You invited me. No, I didn't. What? Do you have that invitation? Yes, I do. <laughs> this is just like the other ones, but I didn't send it to you. Hmm. Ah, it begins. How many of these boxes did you create? Five, one for each of my friends. Is there any way to close them again? To, to reset them? Hang on. Hang on. Someone reset the box. Oh my god. Somebody you the got box. it. They, they sent it to oh, you as a gag. I run through bitter experience that an anonymous invitation is not to be trifled with. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. I'd love to have you visit me at my home. You're an official guest now. Try to solve the murder mystery. If you can. I don't want to toot my own horn, but it's pretty next level. It's, wow. It started. I'm it's already excited because this is fun. I think I'll go for a swim. 
<laughs> whiskey. Maybe I'll lay out for a bit. <laughs> is that a cooler? Hey, me. <laughs> it is. The baby blue. Remember that night you almost pancaked me with it on the road outside? Right? Anderson Cooper's birthday. Dong. <laughs> His gun. <Yeah. laughs> Why? That is quite a piece. <laughs> <laughs> you never know when shit's gonna go down. Yeah. Yeah. Private yeah. Island. Hey, f just fuck in front of everybody so we know. It's obvious. We can tell. There was a time, you know, back when I was the one on magazines. He was nobody. Couldn't believe he was even talking to me. Oh. There used to be an item. There was this little thing in my hand. I preferred that. <laughs> Love it. Damn, she heard all that. How long has it been since the trial? So a few months. That was not fun for anybody, right, Peg? <laughs> Peg's geeked out on something. <laughs> what first drew you all together? Disruptors recognize each other. You've used that word before. What does that mean? You're I mean, sitting next to Birdie J. She was a fashion icon. And then the youngest editor ever of Shishi Magazine. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was the whole thing with the Halloween costume. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. boy. Tribute to Beyonce. A tribute. Oh, oh my God. Oh, what did you do? <laughs> I think we all knew no. what she did. Lionel, you didn't wait 10 years looking on the taint of academia to get permission to start pushing <laughs> the boundaries of science. He just did it. That's what that's what I did with Alf. Mm -hmm. What we did with Alpha. Disrupt. Be willing to break the thing that nobody well, wants you to break. The glass house is going down. Even your partner will say, you need to stop. She's like right there. Nobody wants you to break the system itself. That is what true disruption is. I don't think that any of them are disruptors. <laughs> yeah. I think they're all conning themselves. Yeah. Can you spot the other thing? Everybody knows who Lionel works for. That's no secret. And we know who bankrolled Claire's campaign. Mm, he's the money. When Duke got banned from Twitch for hawking rhino horn boner pills to teenage boys. With zero rhino on those pills. <laughs> <laughs> Every single one of you was holding on for dear life to Miles Bryan's golden titties. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, dinner's at eight. <laughs> oh, God. I don't like Miles. Something's off. What do you mean? You drinking that shit? Please don't do this. Bird showed me the statement that you wanted to make to the press about Bangladesh. You make her go through with it. Her name is destroyed. It is her only way out. Only way out? For what? She's in some mm, troubles. Maybe there's some behind the scenes litigation. <laughs> so funny. Dong. I hate it and I love it all the time. Yeah. <laughs> what the? This is a <laughs> Put it in the wall. <laughs> well, yeah. Are you even remotely surprised, bro? I'm sorry. This yeah. is like wildly obvious. Oh, yeah, she, oh. has, she has. Are you gonna do it for me? But like everybody's He's... using him for a resource. I bet she's... exactly. So we got one person with. Mo we've got two people with motive now. Yep. Yeah, possibly a third. Possibly looking at Birdie third. without Wh whiskeys. Whiskeys gold digging. Oh shit! And uh, his scientist too. Lionel. I think Peg would do it for Birdie. Jeremy Renner made hot sauce. Jeremy Renner made hot sauce. Renner. I think that's actually a real thing. This place is the Tate Modern. Why would you hang a framed print of the Mona Lisa front and center? It's like having a Che poster <laughs> in your dorm room. Or, is that a print? Louvre's clothes, France needed money. Oh my, no shit. Let's check this out. Oh my God. I had a little override button installed. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. It's classic. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he did it. The first night that we hung out in the Glass Onion, what did I say? I want to be responsible for something that gets mentioned in the same breath as the Mona Lisa forever. Why do you have the Mona Lisa? I've invited world leaders and members of the press from all over to come to this island. I'm going to unveil the future. Crack? Drugs? Good old crack. That's a new solid hydrogen fuel. Oh. <gasps> Zero carbon emissions derived from abundant seawater. What? Dude, that would be tight as fuck. We are going to announce Clear America. With a K? <laughs> I told you I need two years minimum. Claire and I are not going to be responsible for putting something out in the world before it is tested and... That's how he powers the island. Oh yeah. No, you're going to get somebody killed. You're not getting out. It's already happening. They can't just walk away. They've been bought. Alongside and underneath the parte, you've been charged with a serious task. A murder will be committed. My murder. But if anyone can name the killer, and most importantly, what was the motive? That person wins our game. Whiskey. With whiskey, because she uh, wanted more whiskey. What are we with? What do you, what do you want? <laughs> An iPad. <laughs> <laughs> the winner gets an iPad. I don't actually need an iPad. 
<laughs> this will take the whole weekend. Have we started already? Is it? Yeah. Why not? As Watson said to Holmes, it was Bertie who planted a remote device on the cross in revenge for you stealing her signature Ren Diamond. <laughs> <laughs> it triangulates. Oh no, shit! Perfectly with that thing aimed directly at Mr. <laughs> Figured it out right away. Colorful crime for a Oh, he's so mad. <laughs> he worked on this for the last two years. This crime clashed <laughs> with the presence of Benoit Palkir. <laughs> the fuck off my island. <laughs> what was I? That was not the simplest thing to set up. Yeah, I would have waited like a couple of hours, maybe. I hired Jillian Flynn to write. <laughs> I love Jillian Flynn. I, I ruined your game on purpose and for a very good reason. You've taken seven people, each of whom has a real life reason to wish you harm and place the idea of your murder in their heads. It's just suicide. It's like, putting a, loaded, it's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off the lights. Come on, Bertie. Bangladesh. Squiddy pants are manufactured there in a sweatshop. Uh, or making Bertie take the fall to cover your ass is the made in best. Uh, we all know why Duke wants to kill you. He doesn't know about that. No. no. <laughs> oh, this is the famous napkin. I sketched out the original idea for Alpha on a cocktail napkin and I showed it to Andy one night at the Glass Onion. They tore it down the year after that. You made money off of Alpha all those years. You got yours. No, he. Got his from me. We're sorry. What do you want? Are you really asking me that? Yes. Mm -hmm. You want revenge? You want to slit Miles' throat? Just drop the bombshell. Say it. I think she does it. I want the truth. The truth is that we are all holding on to that golden chip. You're the loser. There. That's the truth. Hmm. Come on, guys. Mm. Did she just take his gun? Maybe. No. She did bump into him. Check his gun, though. Keep smiling. It's hey, going. Hey, it's hey, going. Hey, all over the internet. No, no, it's, it's still there. Never mind. Yeah, we can talk alpha news. You bet your ass. Come here. <laughs> yeah, it's I'm nervous. Oh, he's drinking bullet bourbon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he's gonna get shot. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Birdie, that's amazing. Just, just. They just switch drinks. You catch that? Yep, I saw that. Miles has his drink and he has Miles's drink. Correct. Did Miles give him the drink or did he grab it? No, he Miles gave it to him. They, yeah. I think it's whiskey. We're all starting in the pool tonight. That's what I want. Oh no, he's dying. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Oh! No one's gonna hit him with the Heimlich? Yeah. I mean, I don't think he's that kind of joking. He's poisoned. Damn, they killed Batista? It was whiskey. Oh my god! Nobody touched the body. Are, are you treating this as a crime scene? Yes. I can see the headlines. Governor jets off to Greece in a pandemic with a men's rights YouTuber who dies. <laughs> <laughs> my guess is something was put in his drink. So you think Miles switched drinks with him? Yes. Maybe did the poison. It didn't look like he was on out. purpose though. I don't know. Oh, can't come to low tide in the morning, 6 a.m. at the earliest. Miles' dumbass Banksy doc was set to low tide height and it isn't buoyant. It is a piece of shit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody tempered his. He picked up mine. Oh, cool. Yeah, see? I thought it was like an accident, but they weren't paying attention. Mm. <laughs> Miles, it's us. Miles, baby, for real? Peg. Where's Duke's phone? Yeah. Must be here. Yeah, I just saw it. Must have dropped it somewhere. Let's just wait for it to ding again. Good about the phone. Look. Gun's gone. Uh, it's whiskey. We need to find Andy. Oh, Mr. 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 Brawl. <laughs> no, no, it's happening. What is the matter? It was the game. Lights gonna go out. What happens at 10 o'clock? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. It was Andy! She killed Duke and she tore her room apart! I saw her! Uh, you're sus. This is like Among Us. It is, they're just doing Among Us. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Helen, did you take Duke's gun? How could I take Duke's gun? I think it was that politician lady when she bumped into him. Yeah, yeah I, I think. Oh, and a glove? Oh, they're going for Andy. No, I think he's going for. Only you can. Oh! Yeah. Really? I think it's a politician. Nah. Peg? Nah. I think it's Miles. I agree. What I think it's Peg. Miles? Yeah. yeah. I think it's Miles. I'm Peg. Glass onion, but the obvious is cent or the center. Miles has got a reason to kill everybody. The center is obvious. Yeah. Yeah, I can see that, dude. He has motive. All right, that's a bet. Miles? All right. I got one of them. It's Miles and Whiskey. I'm saying Peg. Only one person can tell us who killed Cassandra Brand. Yeah, who dropped yeah. off the box? 
Well, you, uh, Grant? you Grant? You Grant in this what motherfucker. What the hell? <laughs> Bro, what? Oh, I love him. Fucking Mickey Blue Eyes. Andy dropped off the box. Oh, my. It is Andy. My name is Helen Brand. Mr. Blunt, two days ago, I received a call. My twin sister committed suicide. She's not her. In her garage. Engine running. Oh, no. My sister was Cassandra Brand. Impressive woman, your sister. No, she kept a journal every day of her life since she was six years old. Well, that's why she hasn't been talking that much. Andy didn't commit suicide. She sent this at 4 p.m. the day she was murdered, four days ago. That's why Miles was so surprised when he was like, you're here. Yeah. Mm. You give me all one last chance to make things right and know where to find me. I'm assuming all of these uh, names here. Ferdy J, Duke Cody, Claire DeBella, and Lionel Tucson. Nobody writes back anything. I searched every inch of every room in her house and guess what wasn't there? The red envelope. Oh. You want to hire me to go to that island? I've not seen your sister's death in the news. Did you release a statement? No. I could keep it from leaking to the press for another week. Come with me as your sister. What? No, oh, it's his idea. He feels like he got her killed. And your presence on that island is the essential catalyst. I mean, it's a good idea. It's a great idea. Is it safe? No. I'm not a bodyguard. One of those shitheads killed my sister. I'm so sad she's dead too. Mm. Aww. <laughs> she's so comfy. Look at that kitty. Just chilling. All of her TED talks on this thing and I've been studying. Good. The dog ate the caviar. There you go. <laughs> Why would they kill her to protect him? What about Miles? Can't rule it out, but Miles Brown is not an idiot. To risk committing murder after a very public court case would be an exceedingly stupid thing to do. This whiskey. We used to hang together at this bar. Uh, and Miles was leader of the pack. Andy was. They were all friends with Andy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. His goober hair. Nerd. She found Miles, introduced him to the group. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and things started happening. He got Birdie's show for designs, got Lionel published, Duke set up at Twitch, Claire elected locally, and then the big thing. Oh, she made it. it. He took her idea. He sells him on this whole new hydrogen fuel. He's willing to give the company's entire resources to launch this thing. This could blow up the world. I can't let you do this. Miles had the lawyers work the contract, so she was cut out the company completely. Her whole case was based on intellectual ownership of the company's founding idea. Her idea on the napkin. Which she didn't keep. Mm. Miles was very excited. He had an idea. Oh. Who wrote this napkin? Miles. It was Miles. Wow. She had a reason to kill all of y'all. Y'all suck. After the verdict, Miles suddenly found the napkin written in his handwriting. Mm. <laughs> the napkin. Ah. Found it. Uh. We need to find out why. Hold it. Who's was strong enough to go one step further and commit murder? Everyone's Ooh, aware I love of these. who could have been at Andy's house that night. Kind of looks like, like that Clue LP. Yes. Mm -hmm. Must be really great at Clue, huh? I'm very mm -hmm. bad at dumb things. We need to watch yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do you want this? Sure. That's a beautiful necklace. You're a Taurus? Yeah, Miles got it for me. Weird. Surprised me for my birthday. Why are you bragging about cheese? She just gave her that drink and she, she was like woozy off that drink. Yeah. It's whiskey. I think it's really shitty what they all did to you. I read your court transcripts and you got shanked. Thanks, Whiskey. Trying to befriend her to fuck her over. Two weeks ago, I did it. <gasps> you signed off on the power plant. Yep. I did it too. I signed off on putting clear in a manned mission. Let's just pray that Andy was wrong about this clear stuff. No, she was right. Gas form into household piping. Massive leakage into the air. The hydrogen particles are too small. It could literally turn people's homes into the Hindenburg? This is so interesting. Mm -hmm. I was the one in magazines. He was that was slick. Yeah. yeah. Interesting stuff about whiskey and motives for both Lionel and Claire. They bet the farm and will both be ruined along with Miles if he fails. Whoa, 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 whoa. I thought you said you didn't drink. That's hard kombucha. That's Jared Little. Nine <laughs> percent <laughs> alcohol. Oh, oh no. shit. Oh, that's why they're woozy off of it. I feel good. Oh, <laughs> that's what do. drunk person say. That is what true disruption is. Liquid Why? courage. Oh, yes, when we saw her stumbling. Can we talk about the email? You didn't even write back. I called. We all did. When we couldn't reach you, I went to your house. Lionel and I got there at the same time. Mm. Duke was already there. The lights were out. She might have really killed herself. He almost got in an accident on his motorcycle. He was driving so fast. Bertie came back later on to check. It was the same thing. If I would have answered the door that night, would you have said, I back you with Miles? Or were you just showing up so you could stop me from using that envelope? Fair question. Mm -hmm. I think maybe you should take up drinking. You're just killing it. <laughs> <laughs> so he, or of course, he would have gotten it. Lionel Baxter. 
gonna you hold on. It doesn't necessarily mean he can get out. Do what you gotta do. Push that son of a bitch. Look, baby, we really need this. Who's he talking to? Oh, oh, he's <gasps> sad. Oh. Yo, he's using her like nothing. Mm. What a twist. But I want alpha news, baby. He is my loyal friend, but I can't put him on alpha news, okay? Nice. He's on top of it. Yeah. I'm writing to inform you that the proposed Bangladesh factory is notoriously one of the world's biggest sweatshops. And then you replied, sounds perfect. Blah, blah. What? With your emoji dabbing. Because she thought. <laughs> With the emoji dabbing. Because she's making sweatpants. <laughs> yeah. What? Please tell me you did not think sweatshops are where they make sweatpants. Sweatpants. <laughs> oh, oh you God. You dumb, dumb, stupid. Oh, boy. He said if I take full responsibility for the sweatshops, he'll pay me the value of my shares. Oh, 30 million. He is my only lifeline. Whoever killed your sister took that envelope that would want him to see what they'd done for him. They brought it here. They'll have to hide it in that room. Mm, that's why she was searching oh, to her rooms. You have to find a way. I want the truth! <laughs> We have to find that envelope. The envelope's in the Mona Lisa. He's a son of a bitch, Whiskey. Leave his ass. <laughs> Yo, she, she, she dropped, <laughs> dropped the accent. I think you're right now. It might have been Whiskey. Damn it. Oh, Ooh. no. Oh, no. Oh, it got released. How? Damn. That's not coincidence. The world knows about Cassandra Brand. The yeah. news just the, broke. The, the news broke where? Oh, that's when uh, he showed him on his phone? No, she just got a bunch of missed calls and realized uh. people know. Andy, I can explain this. I left Duke because I couldn't. He didn't deserve this. Yes, he did. He is a bad. Oh, my God. I don't feel sorry. She doesn't know. Oh, that's oh, why she, she thought Andy she did it. Him. Oh, my God. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? Did you find the envelope? I searched every room. It's not there. There's one more room to search. The glass on the own. They already gave it to Miles. But that doesn't tell us who gave it to him. Only you can. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, the journal. Bro, that That's was close. A... <laughs> Hot sauce. Hi. Jeremy Hi. Hope you feel better, Jeremy Renner. You other thinks you're dead. This is all cover. This will be good. What oh, yeah, it was Paul. Oh, no, so no. Different ways to go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep returning to the glass onion. Something that seems densely layered, but in fact, the sinner is in plain sight. That is why this case has confounded me like no other. I expected complexity, but that's not what any of this is. It hides behind mind numbing obvious clarity. Miles. Truth is, it doesn't hide at all. It's right there. Yep. Oh. oh Behind that. the fake letter. Hey. The last moment I realized what it teased my brain through this entire case. Inbreviate. <laughs> <laughs> you know, same with all of us. It's just entirely made up. He's not as smart as he seems. Yeah. He's staring me right in the face. He's a fucking idiot. He's a fraud. Miles Braun is an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> just tell us who tried to kill me. Nobody tried to kill you, you vainglorious Buffoon. <laughs> Duke took my glass. He must have picked it up by mistake, you told us. Ignore his lies, everyone. What did we all actually see? Yeah, this is what I thought I saw. He just like put it in his hand. Yeah, no, this is what, yeah, it's just yeah. 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 fucking crazy. When Duke got to Andy's house early on his motorcycle, he saw Miles leaving. No. Oh. Was almost struck by him. He told all of us. He did. You remember that night you almost pancaked me with it on the road outside of Andy? Anderson Cooper's mm -hmm. Miles had been living in Greece the past six months. Whiskey, Miles saw you <laughs> on your birthday <laughs> in New York. May 9th. Focus on the envelope. Why is he screaming? The one thing that could destroy his empire of lies in the hands of the only person unafraid to tell it. But she didn't see the real threat until it was too late. Damn. Duke alone knew you were there that night, but he didn't know Andy was dead until this evening. Right out in the open, Duke showed him and told him exactly what he uh, wanted in return for his silence. Yep. Mm. What are the ingredients to your Cuban breeze? Oh, he was allergic? Pineapple. Pineapple. Yeah, it's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Furthermore, you have a loaded gun ah. and the lights had even been turned off. It's like putting a loaded gun on the table and turning off the light. And then uh, took the end me. Oh my I'm god! <laughs> he is so idiot. Andy's handwriting. 
Keep it safe. How could you ever prove that that's the original? Hers has one thing that George just doesn't. Got that stamp on it. Please keep it far away from Yeah, me. like put yeah. it back in the envelope. Put yeah, it back right. in the envelope. Oh, what the? Yeah. We got witnesses. Burned what? I didn't see anything. Did anybody? Come on, guys. Come on, you assholes. You totally circumspective evidence. No. Circumstantial. Uh, the contents of that envelope were our only physical evidence. Why did you not keep it safe? I need you to do something. There's nothing I can do. Mm. Except maybe offer you some courage. We're gonna beat their heads in with these glasses. What are you yeah, getting her in her other hand? You put something else. in her other hand. That's something small. It's the jewel. It's the hydrogen. Hell yeah. Let's burn this place down. Yeah, but how are you gonna get the Mona Lisa? Uh, she knows where the off switch is for it. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay. You guys all still suck. You guys are having a very Take false energy rebellion. to court. It's an actual lady. Yeah. Oh, not the piano. Dude, I'd wreck all of his shit. Fuck your bar. Fuck your piano. Let's oh! do this. Burn the Mona Lisa. Reminder of why my sister walked away in the first place. Oh, she's about uh, to Walter White this. Oh my God. Oh, you gotta run. Dude, it's gonna make the water flammable. The whole fucking place is gonna blow up. Oh my god. Oh. That tiny little piece. <laughs> Disruption. Fucking A. <laughs> ah, nice. Stupid baby blue. Oh, yeah, no. Oh. Oh, leave Leonardo da Vinci out of this. Fuck him. Oh, yeah. Press it. No, get off me. Yeah. Shrug off me, boy. He was stupid enough to show it to everybody. Oh, you did this. Damn. Oh. Can you imagine the disgrace? Bro. Congratulations on the public launch of Clear and the end of Miles Prime. And you did get your wish to forever be remembered. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. We all saw the same thing. I saw the napkin he burned. Thank you. I clearly saw him grab Duke's gun. Right. But also, they're doing it now. Right. Yeah, they're all pieces of shit. Yeah. Did you get the son of a bitch? Yeah. So LeBron was just like, I'm gonna let you blow up the house. I'm gonna go outside and smoke one, bro. I'll see you in a <laughs> Right. She looks like the Mona Lisa. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, that is nice. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you I can't love tell it. she's smiling or sad. Yeah, that's perfect. That was sick. Oh, that's Woo! perfect. Yeah. That was yeah. good. That's perfect. Yeah. That was yeah. so good. This was fun. Yeah. All right, Ryan Johnson, I see you. I know, right? And you yeah. know what? I liked your Star Wars. And produced. I like how there's so much for your brain to pick apart in yeah. these in the Glass Onion movies. Right. Like, like even if you, because I think we all kind of guessed eventually, like even if you guess right, there's still so much more. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I forget man. who I thought did it, but I'm just going to say I was right. I wonder if like, <laughs> like this movie had a lot of cameos, even just like name mentions. Like I wonder if Jeremy Renner and Jared Leto get money just for being mentioned. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> just, I mean, they fun. use their products. Renner's, That's the only uh, Renner's hot money. sauce and uh, Leto. Kombucha. Kombucha. Or kombucha. Yeah. Both of those things are possibly real things. Possibly. No, they, they are. Can I, yeah, okay. 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 Can I look it up? They just, are. Just, okay. I know Jared Leto's kombucha is real. Oh, well, then oh, I think Jeremy Renner does have a hot sauce. Okay. And he has music. It's fucking ridiculous. Can you buy a glass onion? Aww. No, Jeremy uh, hasn't actually uh, launched a range. Well, he should now. Can you check into Jared Leto? Because I feel like I saw that. That's some undercover shit that he didn't want anyone to know about yet. Kombucha is right there. It's right there. Up, up, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Can you buy, but to the fiction, it does hell? not currently market I any similar product. Liar! You know, it's the Mandala effect. It's Mandala. Oh, it is Mandala. It's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Oh, yeah. hold on. Kombucha is Jerry a real Renner kombucha. at least has music. <laughs> yeah, <you guys> have, <laughs> definitely like it. Um, I like kind of how they portrayed everybody willing to do all this stupid shit for money. You got a politician, you got a influencers, you got scientists. scientists. Yeah. Like, literally everyone's being like, Essentially corrupted by like homies fucking dollars because he's able to do some shit and they all flipped on their friend. It's kind of wild. Yeah. But like they corrupt to the point where they were risking the entire world. Yeah. yeah. The entire yeah. world. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. The United what, States at least. Yeah. So they make uh, hot air balloons out of he not helium. What's the, what's the first element? Hydrogen. hydrogen. So they make them out of helium now, right? And that, that shit was made out of hydrogen. But the thing, and internet, please correct me if I'm wrong, I believe. One of the problems with hydrogen is that it's it molecularly so small 
that like it leaks all mm-hmm. the time because mm-hmm. it's like because the molecules are just so small so like he's like if you put that shit in pipes it's just going to leak it's like it's because, inevitable yeah Ultra because flammable. pipes are porous yeah like yeah no matter how tight your pipe is even mm-hmm. if it's airtight like mm-hmm. it's never hydrogen tight Mm-mm. you should just blow the fire and it's kind of crazy yeah that, that would even be an idea for us and they're like we're gonna put it in rockets and do all this it's like i thought we did all that and it didn't yeah. work well that's crazy. <laughs> we just had to scrub a rocket launch recently because the helium kept leaking because that shit's hard to keep in. This is great. Like, it, it, till the end, it's like, okay, I just want him to work. go through justice. And I, I guess he got some kind of justice, but still not. The, it, yeah. I, yeah, I mean, it's still not the same, right? Like, he, you know, like, as in Helen, you know, he killed your sister and there's nothing you can do about it. It's just kind of. They were all admitting, situation. I thought they were all admitting they were going to snitch on him in the end. Yeah, so he's gonna I guess go so. To jail. Yeah, yeah, but it's going to take time. But, like, but you sitting there, like, I would try to kill him if it was, oh, like, you know, like, yeah. somebody oh, you was, like, street like, justice. Yeah, because, like, oh, yeah, like, yeah. if he killed my sister, it was like, yeah, it's like, you're going down. I don't care if I go to jail afterwards. Like, you, but mm. she was able to, like, no, I'm going to still try to do all this to probably take you down. Yeah. See, but you got to realize, Legally. for a dude like that, my guy's about to spend life in prison and, like, you're about to get some fame off of that, and every time anybody thinks about your name, and you're like, "Oh yeah, that's the most that put him away forever." Like, yeah, killing him probably cathartic as fuck, but you're gonna go down for that shit. This yeah, way, you you're literally that. just gonna be like, "I'll go visit that motherfucker." You ain't yeah. got shit to do in your life sentence. Yeah, put me on the visitor list. I'm going in. Like, yeah. hey, remember that one time when you thought you was big shit, and I literally took a whole five day week off to drive to wherever the fuck you live at in the country <laughs> to come to this jail to tell you to fucking eat my ass, you piece of shit. That's all. I'm gonna leave now. Yeah, and I'm out of here. Yeah. Like, oh, so, makes sense. <laughs> the, that's- Island is for sale for four hundred fifty million dollars, which is a lot. Yeah, of cheap, it right? Says, right? Turns out to be promotional listing. Uh, uh-huh. It's promotional listing. Make a mansion list of. Oh. Yeah, let's say yeah. half a million seems kind of right. cheap. From a yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, you know what? This what? is a rendering. And it yeah, it doesn't look awesome real. Render. Yeah, it doesn't look it's real. So it's not fake news. No, 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 no. I'm gonna find the island's not for sale. Jerry Renner no. doesn't make hot sauce. And Jerry, Jerry Leto doesn't make goddamn. All of you guys are fake news. I'm not believing anything you guys say. No, 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 look at this. Zillow. That image you can see though. It's a commercial. It's a commercial for the promote the movie. I don't believe it. It's got the Zillow rendering. Is that a real thing? Why don't you go to theglassonion.com and see if it's real? There just go, go. <laughs> Zillow. Let's see. Let's just go to Zillow and figure this out. <laughs> Seventeen see? bedrooms. It's off market. No, it's the guy. The it's the guy from the movie. <laughs> Daryl. It's the guy from the movie. That's completely fake. We have debunked all three of these now. <laughs> oh, it's oh it's you gotta send this to me. I love it. No hot sauce. No kombucha. No private island. It's all fake. All the pictures. Yes, paid advertisement. Oh my god. I've been on Zillow for five days. That's great. Was taking panoramic views of uh, the Aegean Sea. sea and Good job, Netflix. Does, like, does, yeah, it, does well it say done. anything about damage? Like, it's like lightly used or something. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> Probably with opulence and intrigue. <laughs> the green is sure to be reclamation. Yeah, it's like, like using a Banksy the same words. Like yes, okay. It's all That's nonsense. hilarious. You know what's yeah. weird? is like yeah. in my brain, I kept hearing him misuse words, and my brain was like, oh, you probably. Yeah. 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 I I like, maybe I didn't know. Maybe yeah, I was, I was like, oh, I, I'm fucking up. God damn. <laughs> I don't know. Scroll down on the pictures, Mickey. Because when I pictures. saw this, I was like, four for four. the video. Let's see the video. Huh? Let's see the video. Let's see the glass onion mansion here on Zillow. First hand. <laughs> Daryl Zablinski. Daryl Zablinski. He was just there. I bet they've gotten so many inquiries for this because 450 million doesn't seem like a lot of money for a whole ass island. No. So this is not real, by the way. This is fake. Yeah. <laughs> but it's, it's selling. Oh, they even did the yeah. So I, I used to have to make videos like this. Oh, so this I is the pre-rendered. Bugs. It's yeah. pre-rendered imagery. Yeah. Okay. That's the glass onion. That's crazy. Cool. That's, that's cool. hilarious. That's fucking. Uh, that's so that cool. Cool. Great yeah. job. Oh, 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 pictures making. This is flawless. Damn, they <laughs> got me. So I feel so fucking like dumb. Yeah, they <laughs> the car. Yeah, they really <laughs> you hear the glass onion? I was like, I was like, Mark and I hear like Jared Leto's kombucha. I was like, you guys are reading about Jared Leto's probably from the drink. Oh yeah, they even left it. That's so cool. Yeah. It's a little tough. He's been talking about this house all morning. Uh, I'm, so, I'm so mad because I'm over here. I'm over here uh, thinking like 450 million is not that much. Maybe I could just like, yeah, take it. Right. 
<laughs> they got a million lot. dollars. You can, <laughs> you the like, monthly payment's gonna be so high. Yeah, right. It seemed plausible. You the monthly like, payment <laughs> literally just says salary. <laughs> what, what do you mean? It's just all of them. Annual, I'm so mad. Annual per month. I'm so um, mad. <laughs> So this movie <laughs> does remind me of Bodies, 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 but they both also, I'm just not it. noticing, have a 2020 vibes where people are like kind of stuck in a house. Like you yes. get to deal with a lot of the yeah. like isolationism yeah, right. and like that's kind of some shit that you don't, that like 2020 did give us was that feeling of being isolated and them really wanting to get out to the point where they're even willing to invent like a fucking, so the movie didn't have to take place in 2020, but no. the movie literally invented a way around Corona and having to wear masks, like, like, <laughs> yeah, right. um, uh, what's Ethan that? Hawk. Like, like, you're like a fantasy type of deal. Like, yeah. uh, you know what I mean? Like, just to be like, hey, pure fantasy. Like, what if yeah. 2020, we didn't have to deal with it. You got shot in the mouth and you can go fuck off. And like, I, like as an idea, I think that that's really cool. Even because the, we always uh, tried to think about like what the pandemic was going to give us and people making movies about the pandemic. But here's a movie that is kind of about the pandemic without being about the pandemic. Right. Yeah. yeah. Even uh, the politician being worried it, about like, oh, I'm at a fucking party during the pandemic. Like right. Boris Johnson was doing that shit. And like you're able to yes. get that. With, it, it's good. So is uh, this a pandemic movie? Maybe, yeah. Just it takes like, place during the pandemic. Just uh, like if it happens during Christmas, it's a Christmas movie. Yeah, yeah. 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 okay. It's a pandemic yeah. movie. Yeah. 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 I'd say it's I pandemic. like the uh, character details too with the mask, like the celebrity chick is just like yes. a net. And, yeah. and the, yeah. the, politici- the politician is wearing it yeah. wrong. Like, yeah. 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 And then the, uh, the fucking manosphere, man's right, doesn't show just up with no, one on yeah. no. And a gun. And a gun. And a gun. And a gun. <laughs> How did he bring his gun to Greece? He's an influencer. Greece was so broke. They were like, how much? How much can you pay us right now? You bring your gun. We don't give a Seriously, fuck. yeah. <laughs> I'm so mad I can't buy the island. <laughs> <laughs> you can't buy it? Right, you can't buy it. I know, but my mind was like, 430 million is not that much. Man, like, yeah. Yeah. Can we, what universe? Just, can you give us that? Yeah, I'll take one of those. Like it's not that much for a private island, you it's know? True. That is hey, look, true. Look, I, got, I got a private island for you, all right? It's not in the ocean, it's in Lake Michigan. <laughs> <laughs> it's mostly made out of trash and old boats. Super private. It could be yours, At least it exists. Oh, one yours. million. Okay. I, I feel the same way right now as when they got me to join an MLM. I'm just. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> I'm so mad. Oh, more of a barge, less of an island. I've been gotten got. Have you started the application? <laughs> You're really hurt. Oh, no. He got, his finance, he got his credit check to see if he can get it. He's like, fuck up my credit score. This You've is taken a 300-point credit hit. I oh, still hope God. they make another one of these. I like, uh, oh, almost called him Matt LeBlanc. Um, ben ben LeBlanc. LeBlanc. As a, uh, as a it, detective, it's, it's, they're always fun, and they yes. kind of... I don't think we did. We kind of moved away from murder mysteries as a genre because I think we're kind of stuck on like the whole Agatha Christie fucking murder on the Orient Express type shit. I love but like, it. This is this is different than that. It's given us a little more, a little something. And each of these last two movies do have, I think, a lot of social commentary in it. That's pretty fucking interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they like drop like name drop a lot of them. Um, even mm-hmm. in the beginning when they were having a party, I'm pretty sure we missed a lot of the celebrities that were in that room. No, I'm pretty maybe. sure you guys are gonna tell us in the comments. But sure. like. Um, the guy just saying like, oh, I hired Gillian Flynn to do it. Like Gillian Flynn writes like great mystery things, and like yeah. that's Gone Girl. the one she wrote. I guess. It's like yeah. okay, cool. Um, oh, Gone Girl. Um, yeah, like Sharp Objects, Gone Girl. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, love Sharp, Sharp Objects. objects is great. Oh man, what a good show. Gone Girl is crazy. Girl is yeah. Yeah. Uh, but Sharp Objects, you guys will watch it. Great limited H- series. <laughs> it's amazing. Yes. Uh, but lo- yeah, a lot of name dropping. Jared Leto clearly doesn't exist, but uh, oh, it's so much fun though. It's good. I, I like just, murder mysteries. Never yeah. fun. Yeah. This could be a nice little trilogy if they make one more. Yeah. Yes. I hope they do. And It'll be I, good. I watched a Vanity Fair piece with Ryan Johnson, and he was kind of discussing how he drew inspiration for these two movies from the Agatha Christie okay. novels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But those novels, apparently, which I am, you know, I've never read. Mm-hmm. I'm going to be fully transparent about yeah. that. They were not complacent in their story writing. So mm-hmm. every new novel would have some new twist or it would take some form of trope and turn it on its ear. Mm-hmm. So he's adhering to that style with making a movie that is a murder mystery, but isn't the same murder mystery that you've seen before. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of like a combination of Sherlock Holmes and Agatha Christie yes. for me. Like, yes. uh, uh, Oh my God! What's his name? Blanc. Um, Blanc. He Benoit Blanc. himself Benoit Blanc. is kind of like Sherlock Holmes. Like, oh, yeah. he's sitting right. at home, pandemic. There's no challenge. He's bored out of his mind. Yeah, like, he no. needs something to like challenge him. And that's then, right. lo and behold, like it just comes in front of him. So that's yeah. um, really I, good. I like too that the twist. So like, all right, 
uh, I think I guessed and someone else guessed. We were like, oh, it's old boy, right? Because yeah. he brought up the glass onion. He's like, you know, it looks layered, but this is the thing right in the middle. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But then after that, for him to be like, he took this idea from here. He took this idea from here. He took this idea from here. The fucking light shut out. And there's a guy, fuck, he took that idea from me. Mm-hmm. Just to be like, <laughs> like he's able to hide behind the personification. Like people are like, he's a genius. And so anything he does, when old boy was like, look, he sends me this, like NFTs equals Child, kids. kids. Yeah. Right. Well, he's like, and that shit blew up. And it's like, Okay, sure, but also like, is that what he meant behind it? Right. Is he a genius? Yeah. Right. And the only way that you can tell he's a genius is because he's like financially successful. But like, does that make you a genius? But yeah. it, but it's also like the metaphor of like his success is all from stolen ideas. Yes. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, exactly. Even that when he said that blew up, it could be just coincidence. The homie was saying he sends a fax every night with some shit on it that seems like it might be crazy, right? But he's sending it to other people. If you send someone an idea and they're like, if you say to someone, I don't know fucking murder tomato attack of the killer tomatoes that's a whole entire thing and you take that and turn it into some crazy new idea right and you're like see that's exactly what i meant it's like did you i don't know you sent me fucking three words yeah and i took it and made it into a whole thing it's like inspiration like that's what i was trying to get you to like it's one of those things where it's like you look at them and like you're attributing something to them that you want to see in them but you don't know if it's actually there let's let's uh let's come up with our own like crazy ideas all right i got one red box but for vinyls Oh my god. Uh, Redbox with a vinyl? Red Redbox, but for vinyls. Rent an album that I'll play for 15 I, minutes. I got one. I think it's such a good idea. What that if it? I say it out loud, it's going to be taken. You know, what? We have to do this immediately. Right. Pending copyright, trademark. No yeah, place. editor, you'll have to bleep out whatever Spidey says. All right, Spidey, what is it? Fortune cookies with tarot cards in them. <laughs> oh, that's, pretty good. that's pretty good. Oh, like yeah. tiny little tarot that cards. Is, yeah. yeah. So that is very disruptive. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the thing. Like they were all saying things like you. None of you are doing that disruption. Like, do you not understand what that means? So that is like that's what I was like. I think you're just saying the words. Yeah. That's well, so funny. Have been to any like we went to that like a uh, Forbes thing and I saw the word disruption. Yeah. Oh you know, yeah. Disruptors in your field. Everybody One lady disruptor. was like, I'm trying to disrupt bras. But, by taking out Victoria's Secret. I'm like, I understand what you mean. But well, then you're creating bra, so like, that's right. not disruption. <laughs> yes. then, um, I think that there was bra. also uh, a nice touch with like his his f- friends. Yeah. Just like enabling him in all this. Yes. Mm-hmm. Because like, he's paying them. Yeah. Right. And they're, they are obviously in it for the money and nothing oh, yeah. else. But like but. they are in, they were literally putting the entire world in danger because they wanted money. Mm-hmm. Well, to a point. They almost did. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They like to well, a point. Up they, to they, the point where his reputation was ruined and they knew it was gonna be ruined, they were like, uh, actually, I'm not your yes, friend anymore. Yeah. Like, Which makes them the shitheads. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um But I mean yeah, that's but, like also speaking to what current happens, right? Like a lot of politicians will sign up like yeah. sign off on deals that they clearly know are not right but because yeah. they will get money from the super PAC from these lobbyists yeah. from these companies yeah. like we're gonna and, write it off for it and there's like, always sure. people that will make them feel better yeah. about themselves and mm-hmm. enable them to continue to be shitty because they benefit from it in one way or another yeah yeah oh <laughs> this is also too, to not say that he didn't have good ideas because when he got started he was pulling real weight for the people but with a small but it was more just his it, connection yeah, yeah and it was yes. like reasonable stuff and then like they kind of let that trickle down into like him becoming this borderline megalomaniacal maniac also yeah. the one thing I'm gonna say he said yeah they hooked him up with Twitch I don't know what that means what do you get him a fucking camera and a yeah. Like, uh, yeah. yeah you mean he hooked him up with Twitch the people that you push him you, <laughs> you go from, know. he's like he hooked him up with Twitch no get, I think he was banned from Twitch so that he probably like used his connection mm. to get him unbanned or something Recent like that. oh yeah. okay. was he banned he was already banned from Twitch when they, when they first met back in the club no I think probably like after that's what I, oh yeah. no he got banned because he was selling the, the right yeah. rhino, yeah. Pills. Yeah, rhino yeah. butter pills i think maybe the initial <laughs> connection was meant to be because you know like uh miles braun he's kind of an amalgam of elon musk and jeff bezos yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. because he has the intellect of what you would assume uh elon musk has the yeah. intellect of you would assume and then he has the uh, i guess allegedly go or uh, business prowess of a jeff bezos because yeah. they said he owns a freight business yeah, he owns yeah, like yeah, a, yeah. his own network on television you know mm-hmm. all these kinds of things so he's an amount of, yeah, of, kind of yeah exactly Which, basically of the, of the ultra wealthy billionaire who you know can essentially do whatever they want and to <laughs> yeah. point out just the, the parallel too is like elon musk like bought in to uh tesla 
like people like give him the cloud. Like, well, I mean, he invented Tesla. He, you know what I mean? Like I mean, people that, talk about that's, him like that's that. That's what always was his PayPal too. That yeah, yeah, yeah. And mm-hmm. it's like, and I'm not mm-hmm. saying that he's not a good business person to be able to get into those, but like some people do treat him like a genius because he became a billionaire. Mm-hmm. But like mm-hmm. becoming a billionaire doesn't actively make you a fucking genius. No. Motherfuckers over here winning Nobel Peace Prizes in fucking science being like, well, I guess I ain't a fucking genius. <laughs> <laughs> well, Until they're proven right long after they're dead. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. And, like, <laughs> yeah. and Nobel Peace Prize is like, you, it might be your idea, but you may not win it unless I somebody mean, like proves it, yeah, that it can exactly, work yeah. and that they could win it. Here's my idea. All right. Yeah. It is, um, <laughs> it's a machine that you put your pet hair into and it automatically crochets you a tiny little teddy bear. That's a oh, That's actually kind of tight. That'd be sick as fuck. And nobody <laughs> wants that. <laughs> nobody <laughs> needs that. It's like a builder bear, but for your pet hair. It's and then you can put people hair in. And Dump a bunch of hair in, 10 minutes later, teddy bear. There oh, you go. We call oh. it the hairy bear. Oh, it oh. could be collect all the hair that all the dog sheds like after winter and put them on teddy bear. Actually, they've proven it's an idea. It's been proven, scientifically proven, that hair is actually more effective in absorbing things than like sometimes even sponges. Oh. So they're using hair now to absorb toxins from like the ocean and stuff like that. Dude, I got so much like hair. excess what? hair. So if you could develop a something like that, it would fabricate like pet hair into and we something just have a bunch of that you can literally go out and put into the environment to absorb toxins. Ooh, yeah, like, I mean, we're running this business off of Ziggy every time he yeah. sheds. No, 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 apparently, a hair. And it's we reusable. It. Hair is it's incredibly Pokemon. I feel like we're inventing Pokemon. <laughs> well, here's, right, guys, guys, give us your terrible idea yeah. and let us know what you think about the glass onion and we'll see you at the next one. Bye! Bye. Bye.